Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes here on my channel and today I have a jewelry rental subscription that usually makes it into one of my Monday or midweek mashups to share with you but I just figured I would give it its own video today because I know some of you have said that you wanted to try it but it was just a little bit confusing. Honestly it's not that confusing. If you have any questions feel free to ask in the comments below and I'll try to explain but it is of course a rocks box. So so right now this is their sleek little black box that they're using it's kind of got like a nice linen texture to it rocks box like I said is a jewelry rental subscription so you get three pieces at a time it has a $21 per month rental fee they call it a styling fee but really if you think about it as a rental fee it makes more sense in my mind you get to hold on to and use those pieces for as long as you would like as long as you keep paying that $21 but if you keep the items past one month you're gonna get charged that $21 again obviously but then you lose the opportunity to use that $21 in credit towards purchasing one of the pieces so you can send everything back absolutely and pay nothing extra besides that $21 but you have to do it within a month or if you decide maybe I want to hold on to one of these pieces and keep it for my collection go ahead and apply that $21 you just go ahead and purchase it in your account online but you can still hold on to the other two and decide if you want to keep those or send them back it's when you send things back or you've purchased all three of the pieces that they will send you your next set and you get a say in what they send to you so they can completely surprise you if you prefer I like a little say in it because we all have our own styles and needs especially if if you have events or holidays coming up so you can put as many things as you want into the wish list and then you kind of have your top 20 as well and then 24 hours before they're about to send out your next set so you've just sent everything back or you sent back what you're not keeping or you have decided to keep all of it then they will start preparing your next set and they will actually give you a preview and you have the opportunity to swap out pieces you can swap out all three you can say that looks great go ahead and send it but I do like that extra bit of control because occasionally I have put things into my wish list that no longer suit my style or my needs for example if I was thinking about something maybe for an event or a holiday I might not need them anymore or there might be something else that has just arrived in the shop that I would rather try or something else on my wish list that just seems like it might be more fun so they also make it really easy to send things back because the same bubble mailer that your box arrives in is what you are going to slap a prepaid shipping label that's in the box right back onto and then you just drop it into the mail either your mailbox or at the post office and it's very very quick the shipping I have found now I do have a code for you as well as a link I think the link is the easiest thing to do it'll be down there in the description box below but there's also a code but they wind up with the same benefit to you my code is Noel n n o e l n b f f one like you are my bff and then a one because you basically get one month free so you will have already essentially paid that 21 dollar styling or rental fee and you have that 21 dollars to apply to one of the pieces in your first set if you decide to do that if you don't want to keep anything you don't want to be charged anything just make sure you send everything back before they charge you for the next month right that's the only catch so if you want to try it out you have some opportunity to wear some jewelry pieces go ahead and try it and again if you want to keep one of those items you can go ahead and apply $21 it's basically like getting $21 free or $21 in credit towards a nice jewelry piece for yourself so and they have all price points I'll say that as well and they have a lot of great designers so they have Kendra, Kendra Scott they have um, Kate Spade is one of my favorites I love the bigger whimsical pieces by her designers uh, I lately I've been really liking David Aubrey pieces because they're really long and kind of boho so they have lots of great designers and they have lots of great price points so you can get things for around $30 and you can get things for well over a hundred dollars and they even have some semi fine jewelry which is like gets even pricier but I usually try to keep it pretty reasonable because I know I'm very tempted usually to keep things so I want that $21 to 
kind of take up a good chunk of that if I decide to do that. There's also benefits if you decide to keep all three pieces. Even if it takes you three months and you're like buying one piece at a time and applying $21 each month, if you decide to keep all three, you get an additional $10 off. So that will be reflected in the final piece when you finally purchase it. You can purchase all three all at once if you want to, but for me, I like to kind of stretch it out a little bit longer. And if I know that I am just gonna keep the one piece, I go ahead and use my credit and then send the other two back. Or if I'm kind of on the fence about the other two, I'll stretch it out over another couple of months. Anyway, let's go ahead and get into this box and see what we've got this time around. I don't think that I swapped anything out this time. I might have, but now I don't even remember because it's been sitting here waiting for me a little bit. So this is their little jewelry care card that they always include, you know, all the obvious things, like you don't want it to tarnish, so don't wear it when you're showering or exercising, that kind of stuff. And then inside, there's always three separate jewelry bags. This time around, we actually have three Roxbox branded bags. Sometimes it's from the designer. For example, if it's like Chan Lu, you'll get it from the designer. If it's Kate Spade, you'll get it from the designer. This harkens back to the old Roxbox box. I think I only got a few of them. I've probably been a subscriber on and off to Roxbox over the past four years or so since I had my channel, but they used to have a gray box with a pink ribbon. So let me know in the comments below if you remember the gray box with the pink ribbon. So, um, and then in, in the bottom, of course, we have just sort of a quick little in invoice that does kind of give you the breakdown in terms of the member price of the individual items. Sometimes if it's not a super famous fancy designer, you will get a nice discount as a member. Sometimes there's not really a discount at all. And then on the other side, of course, it is that prepaid shipping label that I was talking about. So I'm going to prop up the little notes that it says about my set. It shows me like if I have any credit if from referrals, for example, if you happen to use my link or my code, I get a little referral credit or the buy three discount, for example. So it kind of breaks it all down for you. But let's go ahead and see what the first item is that I chose this time around. Oh, these are fun. So this is from Perry Street, which I feel like is maybe one of their almost in-house brands. But I was kind of starting to think about the holidays. And I thought these were really, really pretty and kind of classic. They almost have like a vintage look to them. So these are the Perry Street Diane Statement Drops. They feel a little bit heavy in my hand. I don't usually have too much problems with weight. Um, you just have to think about what you're doing. Like if you're going to wear these to a wedding, which I think they would be really pretty with a lot of wedding uh, outfits then you might not want to do a ton of dancing where you're jumping around. They have a simple post background, but as you can see, they have the gold outline, and I do prefer gold, but they kind of have this gray, almost icy stone in there, which I kind of like how it's a mixing of the two. So they have that wintry vibe to them, but still the warmth of a gold piece. So let me actually, uh, which is similar to the earrings that I'm wearing here from YSM Design. So let me go ahead and try these. These are $55. That is the member price. I'm not sure what the regular retail price is on these, but let me see. It looks like my post looks a little tiny bit bent. Usually I can fix those. Um, and they have all kinds of fun sales too. I haven't actually taken advantage of the sales of items, you know, that have been kind of in rotation for a while. Obviously they sanitize everything, make sure everything's in good condition for you. But I actually think these are really fun. They don't feel that heavy. They show up great in my hair but as you can see again I think these would be fantastic for the holidays and the winter season when you just want to add a touch of glam to them so you know $55 subtract the 21 then we're just paying another what $34 that's not too bad it kind of breaks up the payment that way for you too with the credit working this one feels a little bit heftier I'm not sure what I selected here oh this is a this is kind of a you know summer holdover I didn't hadn't tried it but I figured I'd get it uh, this is from slate which is a like kind of another what I think of as like a rocks box brand this is the Kai resin necklace in multi and gold it is $51 which I do think is still a little bit pricey for what feels like kind of like costume jewelry it also feels kind of vintage to me has almost like an 80s vibe like I feel like I would have seen this in my grandma's like vacation jewelry collection for example but I do really like these resin links they almost have some swirling in them so they almost look like stones or something it's not super duper heavy uh, it does have a little extender chain but I think this could look really fun with like a 
I was gonna say like a pinafore, but like a summer dress if it has one of these colors in it or just white or kind of peeking out from under a white button down. I think that could be fun. Obviously it's not really working here with my plaid and embroidered shirt, but I do think it's kind of fun. It's pretty sophisticated. It could add a touch of whimsy or playfulness to a more um, demure or more um, serious like business outfit. It kind of has that kind of power statement necklace vibe to it. It's actually a little bit longer than I thought, but again, if you were wearing something with a more open neckline or, you know, a lower like a sundress, I do think it could work. This is an example of a piece that I probably wouldn't keep for, even though it's not that bad, it's another $30. I probably would just use it for the summer season and I do think I still have some warm weather ahead here in San Diego so we'll see if it like makes an appearance but it's not necessarily something that I would keep but it's something that is really fun to get to try and that's how you get to do it is through Roxbox and I'd like all the rainbow colors I thought those were fun too so let's actually have a secret password while we're at it you guys so when you come across a secret password in one of my videos you want to enter it along with your contact information in the Google form linked for you in the description box below please don't put it in the comments I have to delete those comments even when they're really good ones because it's supposed to be a secret password and then five days into the following month so in October I'll use a random number picker to select a few winners to receive a mystery box as my way of saying thank you so much for watching my videos you have to be 18 years or older you have to have a US or Canadian mailing address and you do have to be subscribed to my channel and just as a reminder it is not affiliated with YouTube or any of the boxes that I open here on the channel it's just my way of saying thank you so much for watching the videos and trying to watch them in their entirety which is how you find the secret passwords. So let's have our secret password for today be rainbow because we have this fun rainbow resin necklace from Roxbox this month. And then we have one final item. I'm a little scared because I don't even remember what this piece is, but it's by Soko, which is a fantastic brand. Um, I've really liked their sort of minimalist designs. I've actually kept a few of their earrings when I had like a lot of credit to go ahead and burn. I don't have a lot of credit to burn now. This is their Meta Pendant Necklace in Gold. You guys, this is $118. So, you know, for example, that necklace, something fun that I don't necessarily need to keep, but I might try wearing a couple of times, sure. This might be beautiful, it might be something I would absolutely love to keep, but I just can't afford to keep it. So the Roxbox uh, subscription obviously, again, gives me that opportunity to just try it for a little while, maybe build up a little bit more credit, maybe add it to uh, back to my wish list, and hopefully even get people to shop from my wish list, because you can actually make individual purchases. You don't have to just use the subscription service. So this is very simple. It's just, it's typical me. It is super simple and super <laughs> expensive. So this is what it looks like. It just is a big disc. I didn't realize it was quite as big as it is, but it just has sort of um, some etching, um, some texture there on one side, and then it's just flat and shiny on the other side. So this has been in my wish list for an awfully long time, and I think that I might have pulled the trigger. I might have actually swapped something out from my set preview, forgetting how much it is. <laughs> But I will happily wear it a few times. So it is a shorter chain length, which I actually prefer um, just because of the neckline of most of the things that I wear. So I don't know that I'll be able to actually put it on because usually I kind of get stuck in my hair when I'm trying stuff on on camera and it just doesn't want to go. But this is about as short as it will go and then it will go longer. But it's definitely my style. I love how it catches the light. Um, it's actually flat on the on the back side. So I'm not sure that I like that. I wish that, you know, if you're going to pay that much, I feel like it should be textured and have that design on both sides. So it is getting caught in my hair. So I'm wearing, so you can see, it's just a flat, plain disc on the other side. I guess to some people that's like a two-sided pendant. You could wear it facing that way. And on this side, it's like this. I'm actually noticing that the flat side kind of gets fingerprints already, which might be frustrating. I'll have to try it because when they are pendants like this, and they just kind of run uh, up and down the chain. I always have the problem of them, of the clasp coming down and um, hitting the pendant. So I feel like that might actually annoy me quite a bit. So it's a little bit shorter. I think you could go a little bit longer with it, obviously. Let me see if I can push it down to the full length of the extender chain, which is not honestly that long. Of course, because it is a pendant, you could put it on your own chain, but hopefully this is a good quality one for the price again. I think it's lovely. Do I think I would keep it for $118?
most likely not but you guys let me know what you thought about this set all very different right this is very me in its minimalist style um also in its price point that's very me to select that but i'm a little bit concerned about it being fingerprint prone and then the resin necklace our rainbow necklace super duper fun see it's plain on the back flip around I'm worried about it flipping around on me too and not showing that beautiful design side. So there's what it looks like on that side. I'm really loving the earrings. Honestly, I think for just paying another $34 and having some great holiday earrings, I might hold on to these because they'd look great with jeans and a sweater and they'd look great with an evening gown as well. But let me know your input. I always love to hear from you in the in the comments below and if you got to this point and you missed it there was a secret password so make sure you go back and watch it and i'll see you all very very soon in my next unboxing